Now to understand the difference between select and select many. So think of the scenario. We have three kids here. And of these three kids, kid one has two toys. Kid two has one toy. Kid three has two toys. So what you're seeing is for each kid. So this is a list. So we have a list here defined. And notice the commas here separating the list items. But within each item, there is another list. And that list is list of toys. So you can imagine three kids holding their own bag. And within their bag, they have the toys. So when we use the select method, what that does is pertains a list of toy lists. So for example, if I run this code here, you can see what's happening. So what we are getting here is each kid is just simply passing out their bag and in that bag are their toys. So we're just getting this output over here. So we can see kid one, their bag have been passed, their bag have been passed, and their bag have been passed. But what I really wanted was for each of the kids could give me, take out the toy from their bag and give them to me. So that's where select many methods come in. The syntax is pretty pretty much the same. So you can see we're just using kit toys, which we use kit toys there. And rather than select, we're just going to change it to select many. And the rest of the code stays the same. So now we don't even need to write a for each loop. We can basically write a string join method and use the variable here. So here what you get is a simple list where the kids have taken out their toys and just given you the individual toys rather than their bags. So they haven't given you a list of lists. Essentially, they have given you individual toys by taking them out. So that's what select many allows us to do. It allows us to flatten the lists that we get. So you can imagine select basically keeps the bags. So it just basically gives us bag one over here, bag two, while select many, what it does is it opens the bag and mix the content so we actually get the individual items out of it rather than giving us a bag each time from each kid. So I hope this clarifies select many and select and its potential use.